Welcome to today's video where we're going to be detecting the direction that players are looking at. So the first thing you'll want to do is type slash scoreboard objectives and direction dummy and we'll type slash scoreboard objectives add direction x dummy and direction y. So basically the direction X and direction Y scoreboard is finding the player's rotation value in their NBT data. And the direction scoreboard will be a number between 1 through 6. And each number will correspond to a certain direction that the player is looking at. So first we're going to place down a command block and we'll type slash execute store result score and execute as at a at s direction x run data get in, instant at s rotation Um, zero. We'll set that to repeat, always active. And if we do slash scoreboard objective set display sidebar direction x, the direction x scoreboard will update based off of your direction. So we'll do the same thing for our direction y scoreboard. So we'll just change this rotation 1, change this to direction y, and if we set our display bar to direction y, this will also change based off of our direction. So now we need to find what direction the player is looking. So we'll start off with detecting up and down. The first thing we'll want to do is reset the direction scoreboard. So what we'll do is we'll place a new command block and we'll type slash scoreboard players set at a direction zero. We'll set that to chain always active. So now we're going to detect if the player is looking up or down. So the thing about the y direction that we have is that if I display it by using the sidebar, whenever I look up, it's actually negative. And if I look down, it becomes positive. So it's basically reversed. So what we'll do is first we're going to detect if the player is looking up by typing slash execute as at A if score at S direction matches or not direction direction Y matches negative 45 or lower run scoreboard players set at S direction 1 so we'll set that to chain always active and we'll set our sidebar to direction. So as you can see, it'll change to one whenever you look up. So we can just copy this command block and we'll change the direction to two and change this to 45 or higher to check if the player's looking down. So next we can detect if the player is looking north, south, east, or west. So let's place a command block. We'll type slash execute as at A if score at S direction X matches negative 135 to negative 45 run scoreboard players set at s direction 
um, or so this will be tactic the players looking east and we'll set that to chain to always active so as you can see we actually have a problem which is that if the player is looking east this will actually skip if the player is looking up or down so it's not going to detect if the player is looking up or down if they're looking east but if we're if we look any other direction then it still detects if we're looking up or down normally so how we can detect how we can fix this is by running another if command and we'll type if score at s direction matches zero so basically if we're not looking up or down then it'll detect if we're looking to the east so we can copy this command block for the south and west command but the north command is actually going to be a bit different so we'll just copy this place it two more times change this to five change this to negative 45 to positive 45 for south and for west we'll change this to positive 45 to positive 135 so now if we're looking south it'll detect it and if we're looking west it'll detect it correctly so for north um what we'd have to detect is if I set the um, sidebar to direction X, you can see that it actually flips from positive to negative. So we'd have to detect if the direction X is from positive 135 to negative 135. So we'll need two command blocks to, de to detect this. So what we'll type is, we'll type positive 135 to positive 180 and if that's true we'll set the direction to 3 and we'll set the direction to 3 if it's negative 180 to negative 135 so now if we set the sidebar to direction you can see that it now detects it correctly. So thank you for watching this video. If you guys liked it, leave a like. If you want to see more, subscribe, and I'll see you guys next time.